What's up guys, this is Baseball Everything back at it again with another video and today I have an unboxing for you guys and an installation. So basically I had just ordered a C flap for my helmet. If you don't know what that is, it's basically that thing for right here. Um, it protects you from pitches so you don't get hit in your jaw um, and you don't get hurt. So I'm going to do an unboxing on that and then show you guys how to install it. So, without further ado, let's get straight into this video, guys. Alright guys, so here's the package. As you can see, I'm covering up my information, but I just wanted to show you guys that I got it from BaseballBargains.com. They had it for a great deal. I think it was only like 14 bucks or something. Um, So, yeah, that was a pretty good deal. So, yeah, let's get straight into this. I did cut it open so it wouldn't be too much of a hassle to do it on video. So, yeah. Pull it out right here and put this package in the side. So, here you guys can see it. It is an Under Armour Pro batting helmet face guard. Um, I got the left handed one because I'm a left handed batter. Uh, so, as you can see, it includes the C flap right there and it includes the screws that you need to install it. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and show you guys what it looks like. All right guys, so here we go. This is the Under Armour face guard right here. Uh, hard plastic. There's the holes where you'll put the screws, but right now stickers are blocking it. Then right here in this little Ziploc bag, we have the two Phillips head screws right there. So you will need so a uh, Phillips screwdriver to install this. Uh, so now I'm actually using my helmet for this video. So here it is. I have the uh, matte black Under Armour helmet. I'm not really sure what it's called, but uh, that's my helmet. I love the helmet, guys. It's I've had it for a few seasons now. Yeah, quite a few seasons. It's held up well. Uh, I love the matte finish on it. Yeah, I don't really like those glossy helmets. That's just my preference. But yeah, this matte one is very nice. As you can see, the Under Armour sticker right there. On the inside, yeah, I've had this for a while, as I was telling you. So this part is wearing off. I'm going to glue this probably after this video. Uh, but yeah, it has plenty of protection here on the ears, right here. It's very soft. On the back of the head, it's soft. But then it has a hard layer of foam right there with this hard plastic on the outside. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get right into the installation all right guys so as you can see i got all the materials that you will need to install this c flap right there right here so you'll need your helmet obviously you'll need a phillips screwdriver so i just went ahead got this one right here uh, i got the screws and the c flap so um let me just go ahead and show you guys how to get this on all right guys so first as you can see there's this little clamp that we'll have to remove right there guys oops helmet's rolling but right there we'll have to remove that so we can go ahead and install the c flap onto the helmet so i'm going to hold the helmet with my knee as you can see right there we're just going to go ahead and take the screwdriver and remove this and then there you guys can see I have removed that little uh, clamp right there. As you can see, it just screws right off. And we're just going to put that over there. Now, I'm going to get the C flap. And as you can see on the packaging right here, it actually goes this way, guys. So, uh, yeah. Just showing you guys that so I'm just gonna take this and I was gonna try and break it through with the screwdriver but I can't so I'm just gonna go ahead and 
open up these screws and then I'll show you guys how to get Alright guys, so as you can see I did have to remove that sticker right there to access the holes to go ahead and get the C-flap onto the helmet. So once again, I'm going to hold the helmet with my knee since I do have to do this one-handed. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and take the screw, put it through that top hole right there, and then align that screw into that top hole right there so and then I'm just gonna try and tighten it as uh, best as I can with my hand for now just so it'll hold it for now and I'm gonna go ahead and grab that other screw right there and then put it into that hole right there guys so I'm sorry guys, this is just a little tough to do one handed and get it all on camera. So I promise you guys this is way easier than it looks. It's just hard. Doing it one handed and trying to keep the right camera angle for you guys. Alright, there we go. I think. Nope. One in. Crooked. So. Alright, I have to come back to you guys once I have these screwed in as much as I can by hand. It's just, like I said, difficult to do with one hand and trying to keep the same right camera angle. So, uh, yeah, I'll be so back. I just got it on. Uh, pretty much took, like, not even two seconds after I dropped the camera. It was just so hard doing it with one hand. So now, I'm just going to go ahead and take the screwdriver, tighten it down. Pretty much as tight as you can get it guys. Don't really want this falling off during the game. That would not be good. Get, get this other one right here. Getting it tightened on. And yeah. Just as easy as that guys. We just installed the Under Armour Pro batting C-flap onto uh, my Under Armour batting helmet. So yeah, that's how it looks. Very durable. It will not fall off, guys. Trust me. I'm shaking it pretty hard right now. Not moving at all. Uh, it's pretty nice because on the inside there... It does have the padding just like their helmet, which is very nice. So yeah, as you can see, very squishy right there. Because that'll be the part that's against your face. So yeah, it matches great. Uh, and I think it should look good, guys. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys um, with it on my head right here in a second. So yeah. Let's show you guys the on head, I guess. Alright guys, so as you can see, I got the helmet on me. And this is what it looks like. It looks pretty good. Uh, you can't even feel a difference, guys. It's just there. Uh, no difference at all. Just when a pitch comes, it won't hit you. It'll hit this. That's pretty much the whole point of it. Um, it doesn't block your view at all guys it's pretty nice and then when a pitch does come this will just come and press against your face with the foam so that's nice that's not just a piece of plastic coming and hitting your face it's actually foam right there so yeah um that's 
how to install your uh, C flap onto an Under Armour helmet. I'm pretty sure it's the same with um, the other helmets, guys. That's just how uh, to install the Under Armour Pro Batting face guard to your Under Armour helmet. Uh, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like and um, check out some of my other videos. You guys will probably like them. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Comment down below what you guys want to see next. That really helps me a lot. Um, it's kind of hard to think of some ideas sometimes, so just let me know. And thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace.